the straights never fail to disappoint me. Are the straights okay? I think that's what we need to be asking ourselves. Are the straights okay? I mean, this dude at the start, he can just suck a boot. I mean, why, why are you kissing? Why are you making out with a wall? I mean, straight people, they, we, we do do, we do do some weird, <laughs> we do do some weird stuff. I've seen plenty of gay people do weird stuff, but this guy, he, he's, uh, he needs to get in the bin. If you are a gay man, I need you to follow me. I need more gay followers. Here's an armpit. Boom. Gay bait. All right. I am gay man doing gay things. Be gay with me. Ah! Uh, I mean, thanks for the armpit. Uh, it doesn't really interest me, but, uh... <laughs> Thank you, I guess. I mean, it doesn't matter if you're straight or you're part of the LGBTQ. Everybody can just make cringy videos. Today, Game of Virgins, myself, a straight white male, whiter than unseasoned chicken straight white male, is going to be looking at r slash are the straights okay? A place where people in the LGBTQ laugh at all the weird things straight people do because we do do some weird stuff, but who doesn't? It doesn't matter if, what you're attracted to, we're all humans, we kind of suck. Here's an armpit, boom. On this subreddit, everything you see is exclusive to happening only if you are straight. It's impossible to happen if you have the big gay. Before we start, did I mention that I'm a straight white male and I look like unseasoned chicken? I'm gonna take this on the chin and laugh at myself while looking at this subreddit. All right, we're hyping ourselves up. Ooh, ooh. Straight people, don't let me down too much, please. I'll try and fight for all of us, but I'm not making any promises. Normalize shaving your boyfriend's initials into your pubes. Oh, sweet Jesus, goddamn, this subreddit has hands. I, I don't think I can take this fight. What is it with straight people thinking about getting cheated on? Compliment your girlfriend because I promise you them mother effers at her job will. She's telling her work boyfriend all your problems, while he rubs her shoulders, telling her everything is gonna be okay. Yeah, <laughs> those straight people, what are you playing at? Why are you always cheating on each other? Since when was getting cheated on or cheating on your partner strictly exclusive to straight people? I know plenty of people who are part of the LGBTQ and have been cheated on or know someone who has cheated, the little rascals. Jesus, yeah, that is pretty weird. I mean, just look at this actual baby trying to flirt with a nurse. And it's so bad that they called her a chocolate nurse. This is so bad on so many levels. I don't want people to come away from this video thinking that all straight people are like this because in my opinion, this subreddit is actually pretty bad at making out that straight people and people in the LGBTQ are just so different. I feel like they're trying to encourage separation when there's always going to be a few bad apples. Over 68,000 single women starve to death every year. I mean, I just love how they used a woman trying to open a jar as an accurate portrayal of this even happening. As if it's some epidemic that if a woman can't open a jar, they're just gonna give up and die. Can you just imagine the police turning up on the scene? Damn, Johnny. It's another poor single female. If only she had a partner to open this delicious jar of pickles, she might have made it. I mean, obviously, if I ever sign up to Tinder, one of my interests are gonna be to be cheated on. Because <laughs> I am straight, and I love to be cheated on or cheat. Oh, I think about it every day, in the shower, and when I'm hugging my mom. <laughs> Apparently, they can't even be friends anymore. As a married man, why do you have women as friends? Women in my life are my family, my wife, <laughs> my best friend, women I work with, not friends, my wife's friends, not my friends, my friend's wives, not my friends. No women do I call or hang out with without my wife. Bruh, if you can't have friends of the opposite gender while in a relationship with your partner, your relationship isn't healthy. But this post doesn't strictly relate to people who are in a straight relationship. It's jealousy, and you're an idiot if you think people in the LGBTQ don't have relationships where jealousy is a problem. Are the straights okay? Straights be like, it's a boy! <gasps> yeah, to be fair, gender reveal parties are probably one of the worst things that have become a trend in, like, relevant times. I really don't see the point of having a party where you cause just, like, loads of unnecessary damage to reveal your kid. Nobody cares. My For You page is so messed up at the moment, I saw this. 
Girls, every guy who has liked you has searched your description into the hub. <laughs> I mean, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I, I do know people who have done this. It's, it's kind of weird. I don't really know. <laughs> I don't really know what to say. I can't speak for everybody. But I mean, honestly, just go outside, touch a tree, have a cold shower, and just, <laughs> just do, just do you. Why though? Us pretending to fight in the car so everyone walking by thinks we're in a toxic relationship. Why would anyone do this? What is the point of doing this? There really just isn't anything I can think of that you can gain from doing this. Me learning how to make baby milk before our baby is born so the baby can skip sucking on my girl's press face. What? What? Why would you even post this TikTok and how does it have 666 thousand likes what honestly i love the caption though i'll be damned if anybody else be sucking on them yitties <laughs> if my child needs it god damn i'm glad you came Okay, so the sound is Glad You Came by The Wanted. Let's check out what we find on this sound. I'll probably have to put like some other music over the sound because it will get copyright claimed. I'm glad you came. Yeah, I just did a little bit of research and I have no idea what's going on. Zoe shared a picture of not only one, but two positive pregnancy tests on her Instagram. Really excited to have you watch my baby grow, she wrote, while some feared the father could be the 13-year-old fan. What? Apparently she's like 20 years of age and she had the kid in like 2021. Why is there a controversy that she's apparently kissing a 13-year-old fan? I think this was too deep for the video. I... <laughs> Oh, what is this? Apparently the audio for this is, why would I listen to you with a nice little <sighs> sigh? When he says, I promise, but he's literally male. Ha 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 ha. Males are bad. Ha ha ha. Funny joke. I don't know what I think about this subreddit. It, it takes a lot of stuff, which is kind of blatantly a joke and makes it out to be that like, <gasps> oh my God, straight people. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I try and find the stuff which is d definitely kind of questionable. But I just find this subreddit it's just kind of encouraging separation, which is like the entire thing which we are trying to prevent and not happen. Because it really doesn't matter if you're straight or gay, it just doesn't matter. If you are in a relationship, everyone is going to have similar problems. It doesn't matter who you are in a relationship with. But that is it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Comment down below just general weird stuff you might have seen straight people do or even people who are in LGBTQ relationships. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you all next time.